welcome back this is Tor of Illustrator and today we are doing the 10 minute challenge the 1 minute challenge and then the 10 second challenge so all I'm using is an A5 piece of paper for each pencil some bits that goes with that a selection of varying pens and a handful of Copics that I kind of pre-decided roughly that I what I wanted so I'm using the timer on my phone and um, I actually forgot to put the sound on so I did actually have to stop, unlock um, the phone and put the sound on just to make sure I did know when it stopped so I did allow myself to continue for a couple of seconds afterwards. Not necessarily counted as cheating but I kind of needed those extra couple of seconds just to finish what I was doing. <laughs> I mean. If I had remembered the sound, that would have been better in the first place, and then, yeah, it would have been more legit. So this was a 10 minute full original character drawing, including skeleton, which I don't usually do character design in 10 minutes, so this was a real challenge for me anyway. I have had a bit of a thing recently of drawing animals as mermaids. I am loving that at the moment. A lot of people do already do mermaids as their kind of standard thing. Um, I feel like I agree that they are really, really cute, but what about all the other animals? <laughs> oh, um, I was actually flipping suit through here. I can't even speak today. <laughs> I'm, I'm also a little bit croaky, I do apologise, I've got a bit of a bug, but <laughs> we're honey and lemoning it up, it'll be fine. <laughs> Sorry, got sidetracked. I was looking through some old sketchbooks and I actually found some previous drawings from about 2006, I think, maybe 2008, where I've done some really basic character concepts where I've actually mermaid things before in the past, before it was a thing. So I was just like, oh wow, why didn't I do that more? <laughs> Never mind, that's fine, that was definitely in the past. And I might do a then and now video with some of that stuff, but I'm, I'm not sure. Some of those sketches were a little bit sketchy, if you know what I mean. So yeah, if I had a little bit longer, I probably would have corrected out the things like um, I did notice only after I finished rushing that some of the proportions are slightly off. Not massively because this is a cartoon style cat and that is of what I was going for. Uh, it's not drastically bad but it's also not how I'd have it if I could do it properly from start to finish. So I am loving the BVs in the which are blue violets in the Copic selection at the moment. I've done a few little bits and bobs with those recently. I'm just like, I love these pens. They're probably my favorite combination currently. I've just got a thing for purple at the moment. So you will notice soon my top banners and some, some of the branding will be changing. Not all of it, I want to keep my avatar. I'll be keeping like my pull-up banner that I used at Khan and stuff like that. And yeah, everything will be having a bit of a purple lift. So, this was the end of my 10 minute version. So we're about to have a go at the 1 minute version. And a little note now, oh my gosh, it is harder than you think. So much harder than you think actually, because if you're like me, you have absolutely no concept of what a minute is. I'm terrible. <laughs> you're about to see this. And also I was a little bit tense still, so I was a little bit like um, nervous about where my lines were going to be. I mean I knew this was a challenge and I knew I should have probably like loosened up a little bit before the challenge, but I kind of just wanted to launch myself in it as it was. And as you can see, it went off and my hand paused for a second thinking, oh my god, was that really one minute? So yeah, I was a little bit like, ugh, at myself. So the 10 second challenge, I was determined, absolutely determined. To get as much as I could done and I was determined to not be too precious about those lines and when you come to do this challenge if you want to do it in the future I would re recommend just get your ideas down and you can always go back in later with colours and whatever to try and correct it if you have the time so here we go ready go 10 seconds now this footage is sped up <laughs> that isn't actually 10 seconds there but um, 
well, you weren't viewing 10 seconds. And as you can see, the 10 seconds is the same as my one minute challenge. So I was really annoyed with that. So I'm actually gonna have a go at that again. So yes, I'm going in with exactly the same mentality. I didn't want to go in thinking, I don't know where my lines are gonna be. I wanted to go in thinking, I wanna get as much down on this piece of paper as quickly as possible. And I got pretty far. I mean, it, yeah, it still wasn't a lot, but it's a it's a better step in between now. And as I'll put the two next to each other so you can see. But yeah, what an improvement! You just need to really let go and just have a scribble, and that's as simple as your character concept can be. You can be doing absolutely anything. You could have done a unicorn, I guess. Uh, maybe even draw a Pegasus. Oh, I want to draw Pegasus now. <laughs> so yeah, do definitely have a go at doing this challenge. I would totally recommend it. It has been a complete blast. Yes, do it. Have your own little arty party because yeah, that middle one, that's where you got to let go of your fears. So thanks very much for watching guys. Like if you liked and sub if you haven't. Just keep doodling. Bye.